and welcome back to the 2019 Total BWF Suderman Cup. And what a great tie we have here. And all the Chinese love their badminton. What a great facility. Five courts in this incredible stadium. And it is tied to two to two. It was a men's doubles. Lee and Wang won it in two. Then it was the, the world number one had a hard time against a 17 year old. 17 year old pulled it off 21 16 in the third. Then it was a powerful Cho Chen Chen. Win it in two straight, 21, 13, 21, 15. Then we saw the women's doubles, 44 minutes of play. Korea comes out on top. Now we're down to the mixed doubles. And it's Chung and Shea versus Hyo and Chai. Well, to lead the way, Chinese Taipei, Chung and Shea. And to follow, it's Seo, Seo and Chai. Well, we've had some amazing matches. It was Korea, though, in the women's doubles that dominated the last one, Chung and Kong, to tie it up at two apiece. It comes down to the mixed doubles to see who will win this pool. Hong Kong is out, so it's Chinese Taipei versus Korea. Who will be the number ones? Who will be the number twos? Well, head to head, it is the first time meeting. Ready teams? Black is for you guys. Ready teams. You win the toss. So the toss is won by Three Chinese seven. Taipei. You'll choose some. You will receive. You will choose ends. That side. You will turn. So the Chinese Taipei decide to receive. And Korea will take the side. They also will receive the serve. Some good men's doubles to start off this tie. And the first up is Shape. Tong, uh, sorry, Tong Mi Hao, 39 years of age. Oh no. And Ranking is now 95, uh, 184 centimeters tall. And partner now on the screen, Shea Pei Sean, 21 years of age, 169 centimeters tall. Well, their highest world ranking was number nine, 90 in the world. Well, they weren't selected against Hong Kong, so this is the first time that they'll be playing mixed doubles. We did, we did see them play the men's doubles earlier today. And there you have on the screen, Che Yu Jung, just 24 years of age. 163 centimeters tall. Her best world ranking was number six, but they're sitting at number 12 at the moment. Her partner we saw earlier today in the men's doubles, 21-year-old So Seung Jae, ranked 25, or tw 12, sorry. Highest world ranking was five with Kim Hana. Well, they did play Ready against to play. Hong Kong. It took 35 minutes to play. They won 
final preparations. It comes down to this match to see who wins the tie on the service judge from Mauritius, Sayed. And our service judge for today from Australia, Susan Taylor. Well, you see in the bottom of the corner, you'll see the service line to see if it's high. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Korea, represented by Sil Sun Jae and Jae Yujin. And on my left, Chinese Taipei, represented by Sen Min Hao and Xie Pei Shan. Korea to serve, Jae Yujin to Xie Pei Shan. Look on, play. Well, Korea in white on the far side. Che to serve, NCO. Strong doubles team and two lefties. You don't see two lefties usually together playing on a doubles court, so they're a bit tricky. Very good in defense, coming out nice, flat, and strong. Whoa. I'd give them a little edge. Well, Chung and She on the near side from Chinese Taipei. She also a good doubles player, so they'll try to give him the run for the money but a little edge to Korea. Seven silver, one, oh. Well, the Koreans rank 24 in the world. They have 10 tournaments. They won the German Open back in the, at the beginning of 2019. They also won the Barcelona Spain Masters. Last year at the French Open, they reached the final. Some semifinals at the Denmark and Korean Three, Open. One. So Seong Jae. Started playing when he was just nine years of age, back in 2006. Oh, Joining the national team in 2014. to the linesman call. Four, Try not to influence him. Attack that time right down on the ground. Seo Sung Jae watches how high he gets Six, nice. He flies across. Four. Great angle. Hard to return.
Placement right down the middle, puts it away. That's what you do. You set up your partner at the net. Sio so good at that. Watch how he puts it down the middle. Nice and easy, comes through a partner. And Che Yu Jung to put it away. Nine, so important in doubles. Four. You mix it up, you go to the sides, but you also want to bring it to the middle. This is why you bring your partner into it. You don't win as many from the back. It's one at the net a lot of the time in the doubles. Seven, seven, five, nine. Well, this double pair has seven tournaments on the world ranking. It's divided by 10. You usually take your best 10. So therefore, their ranking of 95. As soon as they get another tournament, like this one, the ranking will shoot up quite a bit. They did reach Six, the quarterfinals at the Vietnam International Challenge earlier this year. And last year in Japan Masters, the 2018, they reached the quarter. Some 16s at the China Masters and uh, Chinese Taipei as well. Service over. 10, 6. Beautifully placed that time, just Seven coming over. across the body, Eleven. just changes the Seven. angle just Seven. slightly. Watch the height of the smash. Incredible, right at the hip. Comes across, hard one to return. Korea is leading the game in game one. Seven minutes of play, 11 to seven. Court two, 20 seconds, court two, 20 seconds. on court two. It's 11 serving seven for Korea. Chinese Taipei in blue. Hey! Force it too much. Now a five point Twelve, lead. seven. Oh, what play that time. Siang comes seven, right seven, in. Watch how fast he eight, is taking the chance. 12. Goes cross on that one. Perfectly placed. Watch out. Again, watch that smash. How oh, high he gets. Nice, quick 13, racket. Eight. The lefty, the spring in his step. It's incredible. So many fantastic men's doubles players from Korea. Park Jo Bong is here and coaches the Japanese team. You have Lee Young Day, but you have so many, 14, so much history in the eight. men's doubles and women's doubles. But. Uh, Park 
Joe Bone in 1989. He was, they almost beat Indonesia for the first title at the Suderman Cup. Women's singles had a big lead and it was Susie Susanti that came back and Indonesia won 3-2 to win the first title. That goes out the back. 16, eight. Perfectly placed, very clever. Changes the angle, watch the racket. It's 17, nice, changes eight. it just at the last second and places it nicely to the open spot. Keeps the pressure on this time, the man at the front of the net. Swung Min Hao. Watch out. Nine, 17. Puts it to the ground. Keeps that pressure on. He doesn't have to worry about his partner at the back. She can do the work. She's a very strong player. Shea Peishwan. First Suderman Cup. He's 21 oh. years of age. He goes out the side. Well, 10, 17. Getting a lot of experience. Her partner is 39 years of age, so really tries to coach her. And it's so important. The Koreans do that very well, too. Sometimes they'll match each other up. Not right now, but in, in off years, they'll play a younger player with an older player. The more experience, the less experience. Some Great summer, teaching ex on 18, court. So uh, very smart 10. that these countries are able to do that as well. Craftiness of that racket. So Swung J, watch this. Ten. The lefty takes a cross court, finds that wide open hole. already in the men's doubles earlier. He lost it 21-15, 21-13. Yu Jung to serve. Right at the pocket, game. perfectly placed. First game won by Korea. Watch this, 21, excellent serve. 10. Gets a racket up, goes for the pocket, puts it away. One time asking Korea dominating in the first game. 14 minutes to play, Korea wins, 21 21-10. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, 
Back out on court, Che Yu Jung and So Seung Jae win the first game at 21 10, dominating the lefties, getting on attack, solid defense. So on the far so side, Seung Min Hao and Che Pei Chuan had some up and downs in the first game. Seung taking some chances coming to the net. The 39-year-old experienced player, second Suderman Cup. They have the work cut out. Whoever wins this will be the top in this tie. So a lot riding on this match. Young Jay started playing when he was nine years old. Liked the game, got really involved in it. Just out the side, well, he had success even when he was a junior. He won the bronze in Bangkok at the Junior World Championships back in 2013. Well, he played at the last Suderman Cup and really helped his team win against China. Seven, seven, two, oh. Doubles and one in the men's doubles. Just clips it down nicely, goes for the hip, perfectly placed. Che Young Jun, she won the World Juniors in Bangkok in 2013. She took the gold. And in 2011, it was the mixed doubles. She won the bronze. So. Left just out the back. Now Korea with a one point lead. Gets up on it, comes down. Goes across the body again, setting up Six, his partner. That's the key. Four.
Well, Seo Sung Jae, he won the men's doubles back in 2017 at the Sudermen Cup against Fu Hai Fung and Zhang Ning. They're the Olympic champions, but they won 21-14, 21-15. Choi Sogu was his partner, and he also so Choi teamed up with Che, Che Yu Jung at the front of the net. And they're the ones that took it home in the mixed doubles. They beat China 21 17, 21 13 to win the 2017 Sudamin Cup. So they've been there before. Eight, five. Nicely placed, comes in nice and flat. Just out of the reach of Che. Six, speeds of 306 miles per hour that's 492 kilometers per hour so to be a lines person and the angle sometimes it's hard to see if it's in or out nice redirection broken string and he gets it he's back in can he do it Seo Sung Jae with a quick racket switch. And they did. Che Yu Jung places it beautifully to the net. She felt her partner going to get the racket. Here it goes. Let's see. Right there. Finishes it off. He knows it's gone. I'll go quickly. A nice quick one back into court. And they finish it off on top. It's 10-6 with a 39-shot rally. Stronger or weak she is at the back. She knows she can smash hard. So Seong Min Hao sometimes takes chances going to the net. Well, Korea are dominating in the mixed game. It's a final game. Tried for a quick flick there, but couldn't throw him off. Seo gets his racket on it. 24 minutes of play, Korea up on top, winning the first game 21-10, and in the second, 11-7. Court one, court two, 20 seconds, court two, 20 seconds. 
Well, it's 2-2 two, two in the tie. It's evened up. It's coming down to the mixed doubles. On the near side in white, it's Korea. So in Chen, Che in the first game at 21-10, and now up in the second, 12-7. Well, Watch this one so seven. quick. Takes a chance, puts it to the ground. So Sung Jae, saw him already in the doubles. Wasn't successful today in the doubles. Cho lost 21, 15, 21, 13 in the opening against Lee and Wing. But now in the mixed doubles, coming on nice and strong. Good smashing that time. Puts it to the middle. Again. Shay, Kay, Sean. Watch. Nice smashes. The partner comes in nice and quick. No chance. Very powerful. Now just down by four points. This means the tie. Whoever wins this match wins the tie. Four hours and 40 minutes of play in this tie so far. It's been a battle back and forth. And that's just out the side, working the way back into this game. This is where the nerves come in. A team competition is very different than an individual competition as well. You have that extra pressure. You're always playing for your country, but even more so when it's a team event. December of last year, now he's coaching in Taipei. Just two down now. Good serve wide, mix it up. Service line or go over the service line, which is six feet six inches from the net. That's 1.98 meters. Oh, wide open. That was a crazy smash cross court. That opens up the court. Watch. If you're going cross, you have to be able to cover that. Not good enough. He gets her racket on it, places it perfectly. What great coverage. Incredible. When you have a strong Earl on the far side, you can take those chances, and that's exactly. 
exactly what they do. Watch this. Watch it travel. Excellent shot. Picking the spots. It was the one before that her partner can take those chances. Okay, Sean, you're really doing well. Now just down by one point. 21 year old to serve. Puts it away. Really stretch, stretched all out. Can't get that one back. 15 apiece. Chinese Taipei are coming alive. Watch out. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful shot. Incredible. What fantastic timing that was. Gorgeous, comes in nice and quick, finds that spot. 39-year-old, Xiong Min Hao. Ooh, a little bit of luck. I think that sailed out the back, but that was going to be a winner. She was not going to be able to get her racket on that one. There is another challenge. A huge point here. It was out. Display of nerves. 17 16. Chinese Taipei. And a flick. That was a smart move, but too long. Out the back. A little too hard. the bullet watch out here it comes gets the first one back barely gets out of the way but i'm happy i did now korea with a one point lead chi yu jung to serve and that time the linesman said i couldn't see it she puts her hands to her eyes and we go to see what Hawkeye can see. 
from here, it looked like it would sail out. I think it was out the back. Oh. Thank you, Hawkeye. An important point. And the lines person, it is hard. The players get in the way of the line a lot of the time. So a very good call from the linesman. If you don't see it, the players like it when the hands go to the eyes, actually. If you don't see it, it's better than doing a, an incorrect one. So 18 apiece. Two, two in the tie. Korea up one game in this one. It's important. And the screams. The screams from their teammates. Korea won this title two years ago, back in 2017. They got to put the trophy above their head. They've won the Sudaman Cup four times. Excellent smash at time from Seo Seung Jae. Their first match point of the game. Well, this Chinese Taipei duo has played in phenomenally. Actually, really smart, really finding the holes, very clever. Can they fend off the first match point? Seo Seung Jae comes across the body and finishes it off. 21 18, but they really had to work. They really had to go the distance in the second game for sure. Chinese Taipei really picked up the pace in the second. The first game struggled a little bit, but it was in the second that they really made the difference. They lost the first game 21 10. But they bounce back in the second game, really picking up the spots. But Seo and Che, they win it for Korea. Here it is. It's a setup. It's that huge hammer. No chance. Korea win the tie with that huge smash. It was 3-2. It was incredible. They were just pulling it off. Korea with the win, 21-10, 21-18 to take the win. Wow, what an incredible matches we had today. It started off with the men's doubles. It was Chinese Taipei, 21-15, 21-13. Lee and Wang take that one. The world number one, the tricky Tai Zhu Ying, couldn't do it against a 17-year-old. And Si Young pulled that one off. An incredible win, just 17 years of age. Then it was a powerful Cho Chin Chen. 55 minutes, 21-12, 21-17. Then it was Korea in the women's doubles. Chung and Kung, too strong for Chinese Taipei. 21-13, 21-15. And then we just saw an incredible mixed doubles. It was 37 minutes of play, 21-10, 21-15. 18 for So and Chai. Well, what a game it was. It was Korea that win the tie three to two. They win the pool. They're the number ones in the pool. Chinese Taipei number two and Hong Kong number three. Thanks for joining us today for day four for the 16th edition of the 2019 Total BWF Suderman Cup. Please join us today for our next session. I'm Charmaine Reed, and from all of us and the entire crew here in Nanning, bye for now. <laughs>